everyone. Hope all of you are doing well. In this video, I am here to talk about Mire Asset Nifty Financial Services ETF which aims to track or replicate the performance of Nifty Financial Service Index. The ETF invests in the underlying stocks forming the part of the index and it can be bought or sold on exchange or in multiples of lot size from the asset management company directly. Now coming to the product construct. The aim of the index and hence the ETF is to track the performance of Indian financial services companies including banks, housing finance, insurance, non-banking finance companies, other financial companies, etc. The index portfolio provides diversified exposure to financial services sectors and includes companies right from banks which act as a key agent in channeling surplus funds from lenders to borrowers, housing finance companies and NBFCs that support credit creation across the economy, insurance companies that financially protect individual and businesses from losses due to unforeseen circumstances to asset management companies that facilitate savings and investments to help investors achieve their financial goals. The Nifty Financial Services Index tracks the performance of these various subsectors of financial services in a single index. The index comprises a maximum of 20 stocks and the stock's weight is based on its free float market capitalization. The index is reconstituted semi-annually in March and September. Nifty Financial Services Index seeks to allow investor to get a diversified exposure to financial services sector as compared to Nifty Bank Index whose exposure is only confined to private and public sector banks. And this gives a more focused exposure to the BFSI space as compared to other broad market indices like Nifty 50 and Nifty 100 index. With key segments of the Indian BFSI being underpenetrated and poised for growth in the long term, Mira Asset Nifty Financial Services ETF offers an investor an opportunity to get focused exposure to the entire financial services ecosystem. Based on their investment objective and risk profile, investor can make long-term strategic allocations in a sector that would be one of the essential factors for overall growth of the economy. Investors can allocate a part of their core allocation to main sectoral product like financial services. At the same time, investor can take a tactical exposure based on market opportunity, based on their views over policy moves, interest rates, etc. Thank you for watching this video. Mutual fund investments are subject to market risks. Read all scheme related documents carefully.